Um, so Alicia really wanted to show you our body before we eat food. Hey, so, okay. do, we, do we suck in? Like what? No, we have to show Just them. normal? This is, us, this is us before. We need to get <laughs> before go out. Boom. I look like it's just, I'm head. Okay, that's the four. Let's go to the, okay. go to the frickin' Uber. I'm excited for you. Embarrassed. Food. You know what? I shouldn't have um, ate breakfast, but I did. Alicia didn't, so she'll probably eat more than me, but we're gonna try to eat our little tiny asses off. <laughs> I'm gonna eat till I can't no more. Um, <laughs> the first red line there, that must mean non-vegan, and then the green line must be vegan. I don't know but we're, we're just making that up, I guess, but... Well, we're here. Oh, by the way, we haven't even told them what we're doing, so... We're doing a vegan mukbang in all pub food. Vegan pub food, so it's like... I'm dressed like I'm going to a pub, kind of. Um, <laughs> so yeah, it's just all vegan pub food, like... Massive burgers and like chicken parmies. Yeah, I don't know how they're doing it, stuff that's but I'm actually it. excited to try it. So here we are. We're gonna try it out and yeah. prove that vegans do eat. Yeah, lots of food and they but can eat the most unhealthy we're stuff. Bread a pub. So. We're at a pub. It's kind of cute. <gasps> There's books. We love books. <laughs> are you excited? We just got the menus. <gasps> okay, Renee loves me goreng. So. Burger. It, it, Fried noodle chicken patty. <laughs> it's not chicken. Yeah, she was explaining it and it sounds so good. And I was like, wow. Yeah. Um, and also vegan mac and cheese. I want to try that. And um, like everything. We're just going to try a lot of stuff. Seafood. There's actual seafood. You guys, we just ordered food. So much. Food. We ordered a variety. Ba the message of this video is that if, you, like, if you're vegan, you can basically eat anything. Sometimes vegan stuff tastes better. So you never know. Yeah. And but normally we eat really healthy vegan food. So we get like all the nutritious you know stuff our body needs but today we're being unhealthy and we're allowed to be unhealthy so we're having a little cheat day biggest cheat day ever though yeah. this is gonna be the biggest yeah it's like we're gonna eat till we explode yeah so, and yeah. we'll be very honest yeah our honest opinions only alicia's still a committed vegan of four three four, years four years four years i'm not really vegan but i'm i still eat vegan food with her but so this is also I? turning me vegan as well as you guys yeah isn't we're it? trying to terminate vegan the food's ready we're freaking like Dude! Oh my god! Oh my god, all this stuff is crazy. What? <laughs> Here we are. Oh my god! We did not get all of this. <laughs> Look at this. I just heard a woman say that she came here yesterday and she didn't realize it was vegan food. She literally she thought she was eating it, meat the whole she time. Came she came and back and today and only she realized. She was like, wait, it says 100% vegan. So it's meant to taste exactly like meat. Oh, oh by the way, we might have to cheesecake. eat the cheesecake first because the ice cream is going to melt. <laughs> Okay. First. Quick description time. So this is lasagna just with a lasagna. lasagna. Fake meat, obviously. Um, mac and cheese, it looks amazing. Malteser cheesecake with vegan ice cream. Uh, loaded, loaded fries. fries with cheese and gravy on the bottom. Uh, loaded fries with cheese and, and bacon. bacon. And this is the Migarang burger. It's literally fried in, this is an egg. That's an egg and then that's noodles and, then, and chicken. And then this chicken is chicken parmi. <laughs> Boom! Oh, oh my, my god! <laughs> okay, let's let's start with the with the first. We're gonna try the dessert. So are we? Yes. Oh my god. So this is the dessert. It's Malteser <laughs> cheesecake. I'm gonna close the camera. I'm gonna get some ice cream with it. Yeah, so yeah. Gotta get ice cream. Oh my god! What the. F Whoa, that is so good. Mmm. Okay, this ice cream is so good. Oh my god. The Maltesers even. Mmm. Mmm. Wait, okay. I'm gonna get full from, for the other stuff, so I need to leave this. By the way, obviously we can't eat all this stuff, so we're just gonna have to take little bites out of it. We're gonna try the big bites. We're gonna try and use as much as we can. Well, I'm gonna try the most. My number one, and Alicia will try her number one. Okay, mine is gonna be chicken palm. Oh, mine was chicken palm too. Well, everyone knows what a chicken palm is. It's just like chicken and cheese like. and. Can you see it in the thing? Um, um yeah. Palm. So we um religiously watch mukbangs because we love mukbangs. I can't stop like watching chicken. That's chicken. Why does it look like and chicken? a chip? I put a chip with it because it's Aussie.
Mm. Oh my god. What the f it's chi it's chicken. Uh, is this a lie? Are they lying? No. Are they lying? No, they're not lying. This is definitely Oh my god. Oh my it god, tastes I'm like in chicken. Love. That is incredible. Like, this is insane. With the look at the That's chicken. Oh Fake chicken. It's like crunchy. I don't know, like, this is the best thing I've ever had. That is so good. Wow. Amazing. 10 out of 10. Cheesy bacon. Dude, pasta. last night, me and Renee were up all night watching... Oh my god. god, this feels wrong. We were up all night watching mukbangs. Trisha, mainly. That tastes like bacon. Does it? Let me try some. Okay. I'm just gonna... This is loaded shit. crazy. I'm gonna have one this more. This is the fake that bacon. Me. Okay, that tastes like bacon. Mm, that tastes like bacon. Yeah. Mm. Might as well we should do the chicken palmy. It's amazing. Mm. Mm. High five me. Best idea ever. I'm mm. so con I'm genuinely confused. That tastes like bacon and that tastes like chicken. I'm coming here every day. If I ate this and okay. someone told me it was real meat, I'd be I'm like, gonna take a bite out of the. I would actually cheese. tell you guys the truth, and I. I was the really excited for mac and cheese as well. Oh my god, mac and cheese, vegan mac and cheese. Okay. I think it's got a little bit of bacon on the top. Mm. What flavoring mm. is that? Yeah, it's like a flavor. There's some flavor in it. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. It doesn't taste like normal mac and cheese though. I'm gonna be real. I think it has a flavor in it though. That chicken parmi is I need another I need some more. It's so good. These fries are just cheese fries, so let's try that. Oh, they have chili on them. No. And oh, gravy. there's gravy. I'm gonna get the gravy down the bottom. I'm trying that. By the way, Trisha is my. Uh, the we love Trisha. Queen. Because she takes huge bites and it's amazing. This is gravy and cheese. Mmm. 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 Yeah, those gravy fries are so good. Whoa. Why is that Wait, so we're good? doing the Trisha. Mmm. We're doing that. <laughs> She's like, mm. <laughs> she nailed it. I look like a little boy. Yeah, she looks good with her lips. I'm like, can we get a drink? I'm so blown away. Can you go get one? Can you get that Coke? I got Diet Coke, obviously, and I got you water because. Okay, so I read this vegan book. And I want to. It's called like, a plea for animals. I wrote in my notes all like some quotes from the book while I was reading it, and this is how long my quotes are. So it goes for that long. Do you it's guys, not quotes. It's more like facts. Like book quotes from really, the book. really yeah. interesting facts. And I want to like tell you guys while. Tell we them eat. top five most interesting. Okay. Let's start with top five most interesting. Five These facts are like crazy interesting. Like you guys. Like a actually. bad interesting. You don't want to know. Okay. You're gonna know now. Okay, a dairy cow produces 500 liters of methane per day. So that's obviously messed up because a lot of people don't think being vegan is gonna help the planet or help flow warming, but it will. It, it will. It definitely if, will. If we stopped all the productions, the world would be freaking amazing. Okay, next fact. Oh, um, I'm gonna try this lasagna. I'm sorry, guys. I'm gonna try. Oh, God, it looks good. Yeah. Okay, so. Mmm. To, okay, this is another fact. Yum. To produce one kilogram of meat requires 10 kilograms of food materials, which could be used to feed the populations of the poor countries that produce them. So, Ooh. we could be curing world hunger if we just yeah, quit this vegan, I mean, <laughs> quit eating meat. This lasagna, by the way, is amazing, just so. Oh, lasagna, I need to try some of that. I'm confused because it tastes like actual beef. 60% of the available land in the world is used for animal breeding. That's a lot of f***ing land mm. that's used up. Yeah. Animal breeding by itself consumes 45% of all water used for the production of food materials. Only 2.5% of water on, on the planet is fresh water. It is estimated that half of the Earth's potable water is consumed in the production of meat and dairy products. Do you know how much that is? Half? Half? Are you listening to this? Okay, I'm gonna take a break from my facts. Okay. Is the lasagna really good? Try it, yeah. It tastes like not as cheesy, but still. Mm. 
the same. Like it still tastes like meat. Do you reckon? I can taste the like meat mints in it. It tastes That's like so meat. Good. I'm so confused. Um, yeah, so what I already it? know this fact because I've read it so many times, but 60 billion, 60 billion animals are killed per year for animal for food. The seven billion people in the world and 60, 60 billion, billion animals, animals die a year. They are raised just to die and it makes them produce so much fucking methane which contribute contributes so much to greenhouse gases and global warming. Therefore global warming, yeah. It's literally the second largest con contributor in the world. First is construction. Second is literally agriculture. And third is transportation. So it's literally way more mm. effective and fucking damaging to global warming than transport, all the transport in the world. That's Time to try the burger. burger. This is like, this oh, is, I haven't tried these chips. Are they good? It's like the famous Mi Green Burger. It has Mi Green fried noodles on it with an egg on the top. And then, oh yeah, that's mm. about it. I'm gonna have to try this. I don't know if my mouth is gonna fit over this, but. No, it's not gonna fit. Wait. <laughs> oh my god. What's your feels? Oh my god, it sounds crunchy. Oh my god. Oh my god. Is it good? Mm. Oh my god, give me that. Okay. Like, I don't know why, but the crunchiness makes it so yum. Mmm. 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 That tastes like bacon. There's bacon on this. I'm pretty sure. Maybe I'll just make yeah. it up. Oh no, that was no, that was the other burger. There's no bacon on this one. Like we're on a cheat day, might as well drink coke. It's diet coke. You know diet coke is zero calories? Skin. Yeah, what? but it probably gives you cancer, so everything gives you cancer apparently. Bacon gives you cancer. Bacon gives you cancer. Oh, another fact coming for you. It's probably because like Really need oh, to it like. says by reducing the consumption of meat, 14% of annual human premature deaths in the world can be avoided. <sighs> you know that if you know how that mean? so many older people have cholesterol. If you don't ever eat, if you don't eat any dairy or meat, you will never get cholesterol. Like it's impossible. It, you only get that from dairy, literally. Mm. Like that's disgusting. Disgusting. That's how people literally have heart attacks. Because over time, it just literally their up. arteries are like clogged. This is gross. Obviously, we've all grown up eating meat, so where you, our bodies have been used to eating dairy and meat. When she started being vegan for like a whole year, and then she ate cheese accidentally this one time, like on a sandwich. Like, I asked for it without cheese. It was on a and sandwich, and she thought, and she started eating it, and she felt so sick. I was actually sick for days. <laughs> dairy isn't everything, so obviously everyone's bodies have like grown used to it. Yeah. But yeah, we're not meant to eat it. So just saying that. You guys do live your life though. You get everyone, everyone do what you guys what you want, but I strongly believe in freaking veganism. Look at us go. We're eating gravy, cheese, chips. Love it. Also, veganism is like a cult, man. Just a cult. Is it? Everyone's so passionate. True. Because when once you research, you can't go back. You're like, shoot. Oh, can I just say this as well? So, in America, 80% of potable water goes toward animal breeding. Production of eighty percent. Yeah, production of one pound of meat requires from five to fifty times the amount of water required to grow one pound of grain. Therefore, to produce one kilo of beef, the average amount of water required is almost as much as that used by a person taking one shower per day for a whole year. One shower per day for a whole year is how much it is to produce one kilo of beef. One kilo. Mm. This is all coming from a factual book that is you're not allowed to just make shit up. It's actually crazy. It is insane. Moral of the insane. story: We could cure well. We could cure world hunger. We could s stop global warming. Literally stop that, and cure f all of the freaking water problems in the world. Mm. Like, the more you research about this, the more you just get shocked every day at how mm, crazy it is that we aren't cutting out, like, animal products from our diets. Like, why are we not doing that? I don't know we've done that for so long that everyone's like, well, what like, are Like, the main it? issue is the big production. That is, that's my fault, okay? Who do she think she is? 
Because we're trying to eat um, salad to, yeah, yeah. to what, balance it out. Me too. Cool. I'm gonna eat a Malteser. I can't believe this Malteser is vegan. I want to inspire people to go vegan. But I also want people to just be like, you know what? Maybe I can't go vegan, but I'm happy that you are. Like, you know? Yeah, let's just accept everyone for how they are. I'm, I'm accepting everyone that isn't vegan because I'm like, I totally understand. Like, you have your own choices, but I'm just gonna be open-minded. Can't stop eating these fries. Also, while reading that book, I think I posted it on my Instagram story, but I cried like so many times what reading that book. It explained in depth like the inside of a slaughterhouse. Yeah. Obviously, animal cruelty. That's a whole other story. See, people are always like, oh, are you, are you, are you vegan because you love animals? I'm like, no, I'm vegan because like, I want the world to survive. Like, you know what I mean? Animal cruelty is one thing, and then like, global warming, fucking every other issue that I just said is a whole other thing. Should we eat some more lasagna? Okay. We're doing this you for you guys. Go. I've been eating all these fries. I'm gonna eat lasagna with fries because I'm being fat. I don't know how I I feel like I haven't eaten much. How am I so full? Have I eaten much? I've eaten like five fries. It looks like we haven't, but like this is so like yeah, filling. Guys, you could have like one of these dishes and be like good, you know? This is actually crazy how I mean taste is literally like meat. And people are like, oh, but I'll, I'll miss cheese. Cheap. I'll miss cheese. I'll miss meat. Dude, cheese is never going to be the exact same because you're not. none of this has cow pus in it. <laughs> oh, if you watch What the Health, it says that cow pus is in dairy. Apparently. Cow pus. That's disgusting. <laughs> we're just turning everyone off. Um, we're, we're turning you guys off. Yeah. And Ooh. I read in the book that because animals are in such confined spaces for so long, they literally start, like, their bodies start shutting down on them. They literally start, like, dying. But these people can't look after all 60 billion or whatever fucking how many animals they have in their slaughterhouse. So they just get an antibiotics and inject it into them so that they stay alive. Because these animals want to die. They want to be dead. Their yes. whole life is spent just in this little confined space. That's like having me the whole, like, how many years yeah, for, like, my whole life just doing nothing. Nothing. Doing my nothing. body would be, like... Holy shit, please just die. And, and then they get sad. injected with antibiotics, which is so <laughs> guys. What? That means you're literally consuming antibiotics when you eat meat. Not probably not every piece of meat, but a lot. Yeah. Especially in the mass productions. Anyone that's making a conscious effort, shout out to you. Yeah, at least try. But if people are like, nah, can't be bothered, nah. Like, come on, try and be bothered a little bit. It doesn't look like there's much going on. Yeah, but it looks like we haven't we like demolished. I don't know that. how people with mukbang do this shit because it's so hard. How does Trish? I think I might need a nap after this. That's how much food I'm eating. Yeah, you know when you eat food and then you're like, okay, oh my god, did I get more on it? I did. Bro, you need to stop doing that. This is really embarrassing. I'm like a child. Every white piece of clothing, Alicia puts pasta sauce or wine on it. Okay, now there's people here. I can hear Renee saying to the owner about the chicken palmy. She's like, that chicken palmy tastes so good. Lasagna. Um, should we take it? Should we take an Instagram pic and post it up on the brain? Hold that. Alrighty. Hold that burger. No, I've been eating so much. Hold up that burger. Me ring. It's nap time. We haven't even eaten eating much. Is, eating is harder than working out. It's actually harder. Oh, like, it like strains your whole body. Yeah. Bro, we didn't even eat that much. I feel like we did though. That, that, you're yawning. It's actually <laughs> made me tired. Because that whole meal, that's really good. Normally people, that's a big meal for one person. We've got that, we've ate some of that. We ate a little bit of that cake. Eight fries and burger. Oh, that's really good. Preach it, tell them. Wait, this is where we say, when we tack out. Wait. 
popping up. We, anyway, we're gonna say our goodbyes now because <sighs> love you vegan food. We just wanted to prove that you can eat vegan food and it tastes exactly the same. It and actually I'm, tastes exactly the same. I'm a food coma. So what we're gonna go like? work out. No. <laughs> Should we? Anyway. <laughs> Dude, why is this making me so tired eating this food? Oh, it's so why good though. I might eat some more. I might just like wait a little bit and eat just some more. Don't eat as much food as we ate. You just, we, I think we just ate it really quick. You know how like if you eat food really quick, you just get full quick? Yeah. Like... Alright. See Bye. you. Wait. We forgot one thing. We forgot one minor, <laughs> one important detail of the video. Our after buds. Oh, I'm trying to undo my. I'm pretty sure I'm not even pushing out right now. You, you look fine. <laughs> look at me, bro. <laughs> I look fine. Look at me. <laughs> I might, I might be pregnant. Like I actually might be. <laughs> like that looks like a baby. Migering burger. I look so <laughs> gross. Let's try and suck Let's... it in. <laughs> Bruh. Oh. Hey. Living our best lives, okay? <laughs> Living our best lives. We out.